Hey, Watch Lovers, it's Brad from Brent L. Miller, and today I have for you one of my personal favorites. Uh, I'm going to try to give you a, a quick, unbiased um, mini review uh, simply because I own this watch. Um, this is the Tudor 1926. Uh, this is the 39 millimeter variant with the white slash opaline uh, textured dial with the blued indices. So I'm trying to get the blue. Uh, in some light, they look almost black, but you hit the light just right, and you can obviously see the blue on here. Um, so let's get the dimensions out of the way. Uh, I measured this. If you measure just the bezel, right? So just the edge of the bezel, it measures an even 39 millimeters. However, if you're looking down at it, you can see the case actually kind of rounds out a little bit here, a little bit bulbous on the sides. So when I did just the sides with the case, it came out to an even 40 millimeters. So uh, an extra millimeter when you, when you measure the case. So 39, 40 millimeter case here, um, a very slim 9.3 millimeter uh, millimeters thick uh, i'm not gonna lie it's one of my favorite features of the watch uh, it wears extremely comfortable uh lug to lug 46 and a half millimeters and then we have a 21 millimeter lug width here on a seven link style with polished center link bracelet uh 100 meter water resistant with the screw down crown obviously you got your date window here at three um you know nothing crazy nothing uh over the top with it just a, a simple three-hander that I like and uh, that I wear um, fairly regularly. Uh, it's using the uh, Tudor, what is the T601, which is uh, based on an ETA movement with about 38 hours of power reserve. So this is not an in-house movement. Um, you know, something that I personally can live with. Uh, would it be great if it did? Sure. Uh, but then you'd obviously be paying the price point for it too. Uh, solid stainless steel case back uh, as standard with most of your Tudors. Um, so nothing special, nothing too special there. Um, overall, just a, a fantastic watch that I enjoy. Um, a lot of people either don't know of these or I think sometimes overlook them. Um, we have this one in stock as well as a uh, rose gold uh, indice uh, model. So, guys, if there's anything I can help you with or if there's anything you want to see a video on, please feel free to email me, brad at brentlmiller.com. Uh, I'm more than happy to help out. Um, if you want to see how this watch wears on my six and three quarter inch wrist, uh, I'll leave a link in the description to our Instagram page where I leave wrist rolls uh, and wrist photos of all these watches. Uh, I will catch you guys in the next video. Thanks for watching.